Thawing Cryoplatable Hepatocytes Today we will be thawing Celsus IVT's cryoplatable human hepatocytes using aseptic and sterile techniques. You will need a vial of human cryoplatable hepatocytes, one 250 milliliter bottle of in vitro gross CP medium, one 5.5 milliliter vial of torpedo antibiotic mix, a water bath set to 37 degrees Celsius, gloves, a one milliliter pipetter, serological pipetter, pipette tips, a 50 milliliter sterile conical tube, Kim wipes, a solution of 70% isopropyl alcohol, and a spray bottle, tripan blue and a 0.4% solution, and one milliliter microcentrifuge tubes. You will also be working under a biological safety cabinet. Aseptically add the 5.5 milliliter vial of torpedo antibiotic mix to the 250 milliliter bottle of in vitro gross CP media and place it in the water bath. The medium should remain in the water bath for at least 30 minutes prior to use in order to equilibrate to 37 degrees Celsius. After the addition of the torpedo antibiotic mix, the complete media will have a shelf life of one week when stored at four degrees Celsius. Pipe at five milliliters of the complete medium and add this to a sterile 50 milliliter conical tube. Place it in the water bath. Take one vial of human cryoplatable hepatocytes from your doer and gently unscrew the cap partially to release the pressure and then reseal. Hold the vial by the cap in the water bath. It will take approximately two minutes at 37 degrees Celsius to thaw the vial of hepatocytes. After about one minute, invert the vial to see if it has begun to thaw. If not, return to bath, wait a few seconds, and invert again. Once the ice pellet releases from the vial wall, the cells are ready to be poured into the pre-warmed in vitro grow CP medium. Wipe the vial with a Kim wipe and take the vial to the biological safety cabinet. Pour the vial into the 50 milliliter conical tube of pre-warmed in vitro grow CP medium. Pipe at one milliliter medium from the conical tube to wash the cryovial for excess cells. Pour this back into the conical vial. Cap the vial and gently invert three times to mix the cells evenly. The cells now must be diluted in order to prepare them for accurate cell counting. Dilution follows a basic one to 10 formula. Seven parts medium or buffer are combined with two parts tripan blue and one part thawed cells. An example of this one to 10 dilution is 700 microliters of in vitro gross CP medium for cryoplatable cells, 200 microliters of 0.4% tripan blue, and 100 microliters of thawed cells. Mix and incubate at room temperature for one minute. Be sure to mix the cell suspension thoroughly before taking an aliquot. The cells are ready to be counted. The next step is to perform a cell count using the tripan blue exclusion method. This will determine the percent viability of platable hepatocytes. All Celsius IVT hepatocytes are tested by our independent quality assurance lab to have a minimum of 70% viability. Cryoplatable hepatocytes from Celsius IVT are ideal for induction and tox studies, biliary transport, and metabolism research. If you have any questions or need assistance, please contact your Celsius representative.